Good morning students. Welcome to our EBS class. Are you all fine? Fine? Yes. So, in our last class, we have studied names of some animals. We have studied some animals. Today, in this class, we are going to study to categorize animals. To categorize or to classify animals according to its habitat. Habitat means the place where they are living. According to its habitat, we can classify animals into different types. Okay, that we are go going to study in this class. We can classify animals into domestic animals, wild animals and water animals according to its habitat. Habitat means what? The place where they are living. Okay, so first one, wild animals. Wild animals. Wild animals live in forest. Wild animals live in forest. What is a forest? Do you know forest? Forest means what? Yes, the area thickly covered with trees. That is a forest. So, wild animals live in forest. Then can you please tell me some examples for wild animals? Wild animals, the animals live in forest. Yes. Lion, tiger, elephant, monkey, giraffe, etc. So many animals are there. Okay. So the first type of animals that is wild animals. Wild animals live in world. Yes. Wild animals live in forest. Okay. Now let me ask you some questions. Okay. So which animal is known as king of forest? King of forest? Which animal is known as king of forest? Tell me. Yes. Lion. So lion. This is lion. Lion is known as king of forest. Who is the king of forest? It's lion. Okay. Then, which is our national animal? Which is our national animal? Tell me. Yes. It's tiger. Tiger is our national animal. This is tiger. It's a wild animal. Okay. So, tiger is our national animal. Okay. Then, which is the largest animal on land? Largest animal on land. Do you know that? This is the largest animal on land. Which is this animal? Yes. Elephant. Elephant is the largest animal on land. Okay. And the next question is, which is the tallest animal? Tallest animal. Do you know that? Tallest animal? Yes, this is the tallest animal. Then tell me, which is this animal? See, this animal has long neck. Which is this animal? Yes, this is giraffe. Giraffe. This is the longest animal. Clear students? Got it? So, the first type of animals, that is, Wild animals. Got the idea? Okay. Then the next type of animals. That is domestic animal. Domestic animal. Do you know what is a domestic animal? Domestic animal? Yes, listen here. I will tell you. Domestic animals means the animals that we keep in our house or farm. They are domestic animals. The animals that we keep in our house or farm for different purposes. They are domestic animals. Then can you please tell me examples for domestic animals? Yes, domestic animals. Cow, dog, cat, horse, 
etc etc are domestic animals so what are domestic animals animals that we keep in our house or farm they are domestic animals domestic animals are tamed for different purposes we tame cow to get milk goat also gives us milk okay so got the idea about domestic animals domestic animals yes so listen here which is this animal tell me which is this animal cow yes cow gives us milk cow gives us milk then next one which is this animal goat goat also gives us milk so cow and goat give us milk okay then the next one see this animal which is this animal which is this animal yes dog this is a domestic animal dog we tamed dog to guard our house yes dog guards our house okay so dog is a domestic animal okay then the next one see this which is this animal cat it's a pet animal we tame this animal cat for pleasure this is a domestic animal pet animal cat a few more animals are the horse sheep etc so did you get the idea about domestic animal the animals that we keep in our house or farm they are domestic animals got it so in this class we have discussed wild animals and domestic animals okay now you have a work to do you have to write the name of five wild animals and five domestic animals in your notebook and submit it before google meet okay students so students rest we will discuss in our next class so that's all for today we will meet in our google meet okay cheers